Hey guys, Earthskig here. We are back with a little bit of some more FTL. So many times I have failed to record this, but the series is not dead and the channel is still going on. So, since you guys haven't heard from me for a while, I've been messing with my recording software because I don't understand computers. So, like, all this stuff was real confusing. Quality should be a little bit better now, but for almost a week there, if not more, there was nothing on the channel. So I'm sorry, but you guys are here for the game, and we will get right back into that. Yes, new ship, no confirmed ideas, we're gonna go with the Osprey, and let's name it the S, S, oh, no periods, um, Hmm. Boot heal. That seems good. Okay, we're gonna be playing on normal, and we'll just run with it. Pomery, Starger, Jackson, Beth. They will be our valiant crew. We got the burst lasers, and everything is in order. No better time to jump than the present. Ooh, abandoned mining station. We've got a defense drone and scrap. That's good. That's really good. Here we go. This will open up our opportunities. I'm gonna stop planning so far out ahead because we're gonna be spontaneous this time because spontaneousness is fun. Oh, rebels and um. Oh, oh. It's just a beam and a missile, so nothing too bad. Let's get auto fire on. Oh, well, probably best we organize our crew. This is the outlay I like for the Osprey ship. Got to get that rock man where he'll put out the most fires, and that NG will repair the weapons fast. So I don't know. I'm not paying attention. You need to pay more attention. Okay, we can spare the mantis because. He's not useful for much, and the engines can go without a guy on him, typically, so... He will be our temporary repairman. Because I don't want him to get any skills in case we get a boarding party. Sorry, Stargur. You're pretty much just... Like... Our... Fighter. That, oh, moved him out of there. Yeah, sorry guys, Erskig's getting a little bit ill. So, not going too well over here. But that doesn't matter, I'm here to make content for you. How's that for you? I finally get back and get it all figured out, and I get sick, so... Oh well, you guys are gonna have to put up with me, hopefully. Please don't leave. Now we know that the rebels are gonna show up, because this is the third jump. And the next time they'll jump. Yeah, we can probably make it there and the distress beacon. Oh, no, we should have gone to the distress beacon first. Rebel ship repaired. Okay, Re they're charging their FTL. We have to take them out or we're definitely caught. And we cannot afford to be caught. So, first step take out those en engines. Yeah. We're just going to have to sit through whatever they throw at us and this isn't gonna be pretty okay our FTL is delayed that should suit nicely there we go pass straight through that shield no issues there oh okay we got really lucky on that and now we should be able to help those people in distress because that's the right thing to do we're gonna be spontaneous and make crazy decisions and be like vigilantes throughout the galaxy ooh it's shiny background um laboratory fire got out of control and we're gonna send our rock man in because fires don't phase him to help put it out so rock crew he goes in and puts it out pretty much by himself. And, um, yeah. 
Let's contact the survivors. We got a FTL recharge booster and some scrap. Very good, very good. That means our FTL will recharge faster, so if we don't want to wait around or if we've got to jump to leave, it's good. That's all. You don't normally see these prices being even. Um, but he's a, it's a slug interceptor, and I like fighting these ships because they've got oxygen that can be taken out. So we will deal with the slug interceptor. First, take out the oxygen, and we'll handle the rest from there. That is the first step. Okay. Uh, ooh, just barely missed our weapons there. I'm gonna try and keep theirs offline. Do the best we can. Try not to do too much damage. Else they may. Oh, um, sorry, sorry. Bit of shouting outside the door there. Let's turn this off and back on in case we may need it. Ooh. Do we want to hit it? No, no, let's, let's leave it. They're going to suffocate. And. Okay, guys, I will be right back to you. Or, no, nah, it shouldn't take too long. Mm, that's getting bad. Let's take them out. Lots of sitting around. Uh, we don't want surrender, because we're going to burn and loot your ship. And there's nothing you can do to stop us. Because burning and looting is what we do to mercenaries. Because you are sellswords and don't offer your fighting for any greater good which essentially makes you a bad guy no that are no okay 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 yeah slight erskig incompetence there but yeah okay um asteroid field let's explore it one drone part and twelve scrap there we go Tons of scrap. Let's make the most out of this. We'll jump there, but... Hmm. Well, first things first, we have to upgrade these shields, because we've run into more than one ship that has been a threat to a ship with only one shield. So, there we go. We'll jump here and here and... Ooh. Oh, no. Okay, we have to make a dive for the end there. This isn't good. Um, intelligent life forms on a nearby planet. No match can be found for them in the database. Uh, they're brightly colored six-legged horse-like animals and um, could... okay let's uh, let's try to communicate peacefully because I have a feeling if we do this they will kill one of the crew members. None here. Um, they bring us to an old NG ship, and we get an NG. We got an NG and some scrap and stuff. Yes. Okay. You can be our engine guy, and Starger, you just wander about the ship aimlessly. You're out of a job. If we run into anyone who's gonna want to hurt us, that's that's your job, Starger. Okay, um, we may need this guy to waylay the rebels, but, oh no, we can take him, we can take him, and we can, we can fight one rebel ship, maybe, probably not, um, yeah, let's fight him. The only honorable course is to fight the mercenary. I think that the teleporter goes here, so Stargur can wait there. Sorry, buddy, there's no way you're getting through my shields. I will destroy you and every hope and or dream that you ever facilitated. That's a word, right? Yeah. Internet, I seek your approval. 
tell me that facilitate is a word. Actually, no, I know it's a word. It is, yeah. Okay. Okay. There we go. Internet, judge me based on whether I use facilitate correctly or incorrectly. There we go. Aha! Scrap 12. There we go. Oh, there's this distress beacon up there. Oh, we're gonna have to suffer through two of them. Well, let's make the best call we can. Hmm. If we upgrade the weapons, that'll make it harder for them to take it offline. Okay, this is gonna be a close call and very difficult, but um, yeah, there's no way we're taking this out. Good thing we got that recharge booster, or else we would have been screwed. Yeah. Come on, don't hit. Yes. We managed to hit that missile with... Did you guys see that right up there? We shot a missile with a laser, and it was fantastic. Okay. There we go. One more missile strike, and... No. That's exactly what I was afraid of. Okay, well, at least that missile's offline, so... you get in there okay oh we can we can probably take this guy out now here I was doing all this worrying about how to get away and we've pretty much taken him down he's down on such a knot so as to be lesser than us a knot he is on a knot because Erska can speak well. Yeah. Okay. Well. Oh, well. Let's see here. Do we want it? No. No jumping away. We will turn and fight for freedom and the Federation because there's no hypocrisy there. Because I'm sure the Federation are good guys, right? Okay. Yeah. They're good guys. See, we got one fuel out of that. How could that possibly have been? Okay, we're gonna make it to the exit without a vent. So, all oh, will be good. Another one. Of the oh no. Oh no. Okay, well. This could be a. Sudden end for the SS Boot Hill. Boot Heel. Yeah. I'm not sure we're gonna survive this. I am not sure we're gonna make it. But then we might. And then everything will be good. Yeah, we're gonna have to. Okay. That oxygen's back online. Good job. Oh, engines have been on half power this whole time. There we go. Let's hit those shields hard and take them down. We can win this fight too. I can I can feel it. This is gonna be a good day for the SS boot heel. Okay, um retrain weapons on their weapons they fire before we do okay they didn't get off too many shots that is good it's very good here we are taking them down we've got like no missile launcher and not sure if we're gonna get drones so yeah I think you guys have picked up by now I don't like playing with drones all too much they're weird and too difficult to manage one fuel we can jump just barely make it to the exit and here is where yes sell all six. see what was I just saying let's sell all six of them and get 24 scrap 
So this is where you guys make the call. We're at the end of the sector. You guys make the call on what we do with this 27 scrap. Do I save it? What do I save it for? And all that good stuff. We are the SS Boot Heel. I've been Captain Erskig, and our possible destinations now are the civilian sector right here, or the pirate sector right here. Both will take us to relatively peaceful space. The civilian sector gives us more options up here, though. So, whatever you guys want to see, put one for civilian sector, two for pirate controlled sector, down in the comments below. And if I don't get any more comments, I'll just make a call. So, I'm gonna save and quit here. You have all been fantastic. I've been Erskig, signing off from the SS Boot Heel. Goodbye.